Welcome to Hainan. I'm Liliana Worth and this is Spotlight on BOA. We're here amid the palm trees and the outstanding weather on the beautiful island of Hainan. And it's right here in the heart of this natural beauty that the annual BOA Forum for Asia is taking place. Now this is the first time that I'm reporting at Hainan and I can certainly say the tropical weather seems to have imbued the 2,000 delegates here with a certain sunny optimism. Amid the exotic scenery, there were boundless discussions on hot topics such as innovation, competition, globalisation, AI and free trade. But what did the delegates themselves think of the event? Well, I spoke to entrepreneurs, officials and experts to get their take on the forum. I've really been impressed with how it's it's very Asia focused in general and, and the people from all over Asia, people all, all, from all over the world here. So that's probably the, the thing that's stuck out to me the most so far. A lot can be worked out uh, with talking and interaction. If we're going to have a shared future and shared mankind, surely having more types of meeting, whether that's a cultural exchange, whether that's uh, businesses doing business in another country, or people coming uh, here to uh, Hainan uh, to meet, I think that's all uh, probably uh, useful. But talking to delegates, I got a real sense of the importance of dialogue and exchange for Asia's success. But I also wanted to know what would be the key factors for making a shared future for Asia and the world a reality. And what would be the obstacles? It's a matter of time, you know, and, and that's what is interesting with China, is that China is looking forward and has a long-term vision. It's time. I think the biggest challenge is the communication and the understanding. え、スピードが速い、速いということ。で、中国自身がね、スピードに追いついていってないというそういう矛盾があるんではないでしょうか。ですから、中国は国際的なね、そのルールとかそういうものについてね、え、できるだけ早く、え、どうかできるようにしてい